What's up everyone, Jack from the Galactic here, here, and today I will open up my Dragonite V box that I found at Walmart. I'm super excited to open this up. I've, I think I opened it once before, I think, maybe. But yeah, this will be my first time opening up one video for you guys, and I'm super excited. Just some things to tell y'all, I'm still not completely better mentally, but I, I've been working on myself and trying to be more happy. And smiling a lot more so that I can hopefully get my ex back because I do want her back eventually. But I am kind of focused on myself and trying to make myself smile and stuff. And yeah. So if I don't post or if I don't sound like energetic a lot of, a lot of the time, there's no, that's what's going on. I'm just super depressed, kind of. But I'm working to get make that better so that one day I can get her back and we can make videos together again. Because I like that one video we made together. It was really fun. But yeah. But um, without further ado, let's get into this opening. So, we'll open up this Dragonite V box. It comes with a Dragonite promo card and a jumbo card, and four packs. I believe like two fusion strikes, a chilling rains, and a um, vomit scout. I believe. But yeah, all right. I really like this box. I like like the like the little design of it and the colorings, like the blue and orangey colors. If you want to read that, you can pause right there. But yeah, I really do enjoy this box, even though I don't really like Dragonite all that much. But this box is like really cool. I got it at Walmart for like twenty dollars, like twenty one something after taxes. But yeah, it's a pretty cool looking box. Let's get into it. This is like so awkward. Just try the pot won't stand up properly. Yeah, let's try to get this box to open up nice and neat. Oh, just turn the entire thing. Bam. Uh, is it two pieces of yes, yes. Come on. There we go. Here is the promo card. Dragonite V. It's a Dragon type, 230 HP. Got Shred and Dragon Gale. Pretty nice looking. Let's leave, let's leave it up. That looks pretty good in the, bl in the blue sleeve, actually. That looks nice in the blue sleeve. Then we got the Jumbo card. I think I figured what I was gonna do with these. Back there with the little sus imposter back there. That comes with two fusion strikes, an evolving skies, and a pack of chilling rain. And then here's the code card. For you guys. Um for you DM, I do um I did buy an the LBAP structure deck. I bought two of them actually, so I need them for my um Despia deck. And I do plan on making a video opening up one of one of them. Probably tomorrow or um Wednesday. I'm not sure when though. It'll probably be Wednesday before I'll um it'll probably be Wednesday before I go to work. But yeah. I'm gonna start with chilling rains and end on the evolving skies. And then fusion strike next. Yeah. Let's get this done. Let's see if we can pull anything like any ultra rares or something. Something really cool. If I can open it, there we go. Yeah, let's see what we can get from it. I'm so excited to open this box again. Here's a code card. One, two, three, four. Let's see what we get. We got a lightning energy, a rapid strike scroll of, scroll of the skies. I like these little scroll cards. They're, they're always have like really cool names. Got a curlia. A, I don't, a Cla I think her name is Clara. I like her. Even though I thought Avery. Got a cast form, snowy form. A ghastly. A little couple. I still am working on the, um, I just finished, not finished, but like I just not got my kafu and, and shield. Which is like very sad. Because like I've been meaning to play that DLC for like ever, but I never got around to it. Got a thunderous. Reverse and 
a Raising Nun Hollow. But yeah, I have been um playing Sword and Shield, well, Sword, trying to complete the DLC for um both the Isle of Armor and the Crown Tundra. I complete the main story for the Crown Tundra. I just gotta find all the, the legendaries, but I did get Calyrex already. And I'm working on getting my Urshif, my um, cuff up to level 70 so I can go through the to the, the Tower of Water. Since I want the water one, the Rapid Strike Urshifu. Got a Fighting Energy. Got a Chili, um, Silent, and Crust. I really want this Full Art card if I don't have one already. Got a Kaparaja. A Zoark. A Dribbler. Chinks, more Pico, a cute little Eevee. These cards were really thick. A Shelter, and these cards feel like really thick. Maybe because I'm used to Yu-Gi-Oh cards now. They feel like really thick. Got another more Pico Reverse, and a Stelix Hollow. Not bad, actually. It's not bad. Yeah, these cards feel like really thick. And I don't know it's because I've been messing with a lot of with Yu-Gi-Oh cards recently. But like they are really, really thick feeling. But may or maybe I'm just mistaken and they always been this thick. Here's a code card. I could be just overthinking things again. You got a fire energy. A little heat more. I don't like heat more. Heat more is very weird looking to me. I don't like it. A cook. A morgrim. A scrimmery. Of shelmet fusion strike. A plusle rapid strike. Una. Meowth. Well, I'm not sure what the Meowth is doing, but I think it's having fun though. A reverse Morpeko. Single strike in this little hangry form. And a Rapid Strike King Skunk. Not hollow. Not too good so far. We got one hollow. Uh, let's hope Evolving Skies can change that for us. Come on, Evolving Skies. Gotta get something good at least. Give me something good. If I put an alt art, I will probably scream. Like, that would be so amazing if I pull an old art or something. Two, three, four. So we get okay, lightning energy, a shell gun, a swoobat, lombre, temple, a psyduck. Jeez, it's like what, three water type in a row? Jeez. Get an Eevee, with the quads in the background. Come on, Eevee, come on, Vulcan Scouts, give us something good. Got a Ketafly. A Pikachu. A Reverse, Rapid Strike, Wishy Washy. And... Oh, a Pinsir, non hollow That sucked, but it's whatever. It's a, still a pretty good box, though. And the Dragon of Cards was also pretty cool looking. So I'm happy. Can't complain too much. I'm just happy to, to open up Pokemon cards, to be honest. So I don't really care for the most part. If I don't pull anything good. But yeah. If you guys liked today's video, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, follow me on social media, which will be linked down below. If you want to see me anything to open up or sign or just fan mail or letters or drawings, my PO box is also down below in the description. And until next time, this is Drexvin signing off.